maintained by the Custom Falcon Hotel. Uh, and, uh, my name is Neil Willis. And me, Matthew. Anyway, what we're going to do here is start with the door. Here we go. The first issue we have here, obviously, is there is no a catch. So what we've got to do here is close the door and lock it. A little bit annoying. Uh, so someone wants to pop out, someone's going to lock the door, behind, they're going to lock the door themselves. Anyway, moving on to the kitchen. Here's a pen for the cleaner. Uh, a fully stocked kitchen here. We have a refrigerator that's got no food in it because we're about to go. Although this handle was a bit loose, but we've managed to repair this ourselves. And we also have uh, covers that are uh, soft closing. See that? Soft closing covers. And soft closing drawers. So this is all fairly modern. We've got some items here of usefulness that we've uh, made uh, use of. Apart from this, we have no coffee. And then moving over to here, we can see that there's a nice picture. And the walls are touched up maybe in the last couple of years, but could do with a lick of paint. And uh, the breakfast bar that's come with ants half the time, but you know, you expect that it's a warm country, that's where ants live, you know. TV that's full of Spanish TV, so uh, unless you're Spanish, pretty useless. And then we lead up here onto the veranda. And what a veranda it is, because on this side of the veranda, we have a lovely, a lovely shadow, and that enables me to dry this this wetsuit uh, out of the sun and that's that's doing a fine job of drying out there so that's great for divers and let's uh, move on to the lot oh it's got a table here as well there's some chairs but it's pretty manky a few quid spent there could have improved that the only not so good thing in here is the uh, lack of fittage at the top of that but that's a quick handy hand job and the lack of bulbs in our breakfast bar uh, lightage. Uh, that's a bit shite. That could be the <laughs> case. And so now I'm going to hand over to Matthew as he joins us downstairs. Hello, I'm Matthew. I'm now going to be having a review of the downstairs of our apartment. See this? Look at the stairs here. We've got this bit of wood there. That's a bit out of place. So this bit, this, this one's coming out of place, and this one's coming out of place as well a bit. We've got a nice high window up there so we get some light down in here. But then you could always do this. Let's start with my bedroom. It's a bit of a mess at the moment because we're trying to figure out where to put my dirty clothes as this is our last day. I'm going to have to take the anorak and the umbrella mm -hmm. out of the old, very old fashioned wardrobe. And the cleaners come in and put a nice fresh sheet on there. And see, this, this um, cabinet here has got a drawer, but the only downside of it is if you pull it out too far, it comes completely out. But let us go into. Bathroom number one. It's very small, but it's got a pretty drainage system in the, the shower. And here is a mirror where I like to pull funny faces. And there's the towel I used to draw my hands. Here's another mirror to look at yourself in and make silly faces. But anyway. In here you see we actually have a bath, but it's going to need a bit of patching up there where there's a little bit of rust. And round the plug hole as well, but otherwise it's all quite nice apart from the little scratch of not really good reflective stuff on the mirror there. Then we come to the parents' bedroom. Got a nice chest of drawers there, and good for storing things on the top, and important things. Um, and we've got two beds. And, well, you can move them next to each other if you want to, if you've got a snoring partner, and you need to nudge them a bit to stop them from snoring. <laughs> it depends if you have one, yeah. Anyway, but there you go. So here we've got boots 
drawing off. Diving boots down there. And that's pretty much it down here. But see, there's a bag to be up there. But I think that is pretty much it for this <laughs> apartment. <laughs> Thank you for watching. It's a special thanks from me. That's a special thanks from me. But there's also one point I'd like to notice that the floor is impeccably tiled throughout throughout the outside, the inside, upstairs, downstairs. Impeccable tiling, and there's impeccable tiling in the bathrooms. And the cleaners come in here every couple of days. So, and that <laughs> concludes our review.